guys and welcome to Tasha Tuesday. So I have been living, breathing and just enjoying Disney for the last month and as you can see it's still the old background because I'm still pre-recording these videos um, and I have done so up until the end of March just so it gives me enough leeway so I hope you don't mind about that. Anyway, so I've been living in Disney without parental supervision and without any of my family and friends for the last month so I think it'd be really interesting to see what right now I predict I'm going to miss most while I'm over there. So let's get started. I obviously will miss my parents and my sister a lot while I'm over there. I don't think I'll have missed them just yet while this video comes out. I think it'll be a couple more weeks um, before I start really missing them before it sinks in that oh they're not here. Um, just because I would have, you know, they would have helped me settle in and I would have just like seen them a month ago and I feel like probably halfway through March I'll start really missing them a lot. I will definitely miss my cat but I have a feeling it'll be like silly things I miss about him so like whenever I'm working at my desk he'll always like oh, he's there's a chair next to my desk and he always sits on there and like has a paw on like my thing. I think I'll just like miss automatically just going to pat him and him not being there and I also think I'll miss just being able to like hold and cuddle him but yeah I think I'll just miss like him just automatically being there for me and I won't have that. Obviously I will miss my friends a ton, my uni group, my high school group and everybody in between. I don't think I'm going to be crying over them at this point. I think I will miss them a lot and I think I'm going to miss just having the convenience of like I can, I, I can see them if I want, like I won't be able to so I think that'll intensify why I miss you because like Liam you live around the corner. You literally rang me up today and was like hey we're going to hang out, you want lunch and I was like yes can't do that. If I want to see you, I can't. I don't have the option to see you, which is sad. And that, because that goes for all my friends as well. You know, like everyone lives so close. And just being able to have the option to see you is comforting. And not having that option, I think, will intensify me missing you. I think I'll miss driving places. Because while I'm over there, I'm not going to have a car. Um, so it'll be public transport or bribing my hopefully American friends who have cars. <laughs> to drive me places, but I think I'll definitely miss this, the convenience of being able to drive over. I think I will start missing my bed. I don't know when, but I just have a feeling I'm definitely going to miss my bed. And this is not even a good bed, this is a really old mattress, but I think I'll just miss like the familiarity and comfort of it. I know for sure these I'm going to miss having my own space. I have never shared a house with anybody other than my family before. And I've never shared a room with anybody before, ever in my entire life. Like, the most I've shared a room is probably when I was five and Zoe and I spent three months sharing rooms with, like, the rest of my family. But other than, like, holidays, which is for, like, a very brief time, I don't share a room with anybody. I like having my own space. I like being able to spread out and just, like, this is mine. So I think I'm going to miss having that. And it's going to be an interesting experience sharing a room with essentially what's going to be a stranger for at least the first few weeks until we like get to know each other. So, should be interesting. So those are things that I think I will miss most. I wonder how many of those are accurate. It'd be really interesting when I watch this back. Maybe, I don't know, I'll let you guys know um, if it's all true or not. Things I don't think I'll miss. I don't think I'll miss having the rule about technology in my room. Um, we have a rule here, we're not allowed to have phones or laptops in our room. I have my iPod, but that's because it can't connect to the internet. Um, so I don't think I'll miss that. Like, I think I'm going to be really happy that I can have my laptop and my phone in my room 24-7 if I want. I don't think I'll miss being at home and then mum coming in and being like, do the dishes, do this, and like, low-key nagging me, but not really. But I don't, I don't think I'll miss her coming home and just being loud while I'm trying to relax. <laughs> So those are things I don't think I'll miss. I think I'll miss a lot more things and I'm sure there are more to this list and some things that I haven't even thought of that I take for granted every day that I go, oh, you know, I don't even think twice about that I'll miss just like it being around, I don't know, like the dripping tap, I don't, I don't know, something like that. Something stupid like that that I don't care about, doesn't bother me, but I'll miss it unconsciously. Who knows? So that is my video this week guys, things that I think I'll miss, maybe not miss, who knows if I'll miss it or not. Um, I think I'm having a great time, I'm sure I am. Don't forget, after March you will get actual videos of me while I'm in Disney. Until then, I am doing vlogs over there, promise Tasha, if you're not, hurry up and get those vlogs edited, people want to see your adventures. Um, I hope you all have a great day, if you're new click that red subscribe button because I'm in Disney and these videos are probably going to be really disney by the end of March, which is going to be also fabulous. 
Um, I will see you all next week. Bye!